Chromatic Brawlers, a rarity released in Brawl Stars with the introduction of the Brawl Pass. There have currently been 15 seasons with the Brawl Pass, which means there are now 15 Brawlers. And about 10 months ago, a Reddit user that goes by the name Terror Are You asked the question, do you think we'll eventually have too much Chromatic Brawlers? And today I want to discuss this with you guys and maybe a way on how they could fix it or multiple ways on how they could fix it. And the truth is, I do think there are too many chromatic brawlers. There are currently 15, which is the most like brawlers for rarity. Second being Trophy Road with 12. And the least being uh, rare with only four. There are only four rare brawlers, which is, which is something I didn't really like, think about. I was like, wow, there is not a lot of rare brawlers in the game. But yeah, a way I do think they could fix it. If you guys don't know, every season when a chromatic brawler is released, it is originally at a legendary status. And then the season after that, it goes to a mythic. And then it goes to an epic, and it stays at an epic. So the brawlers, as you can see up here, Surge, Glet, Lou, Colonel Rust, Bell, and Buzz, they are currently sitting at an epic rarity, even though they have the chromatic background. And a way I think they could change it is how, which is like a basic thing, which I think is like the easiest, is chromatic brawlers that have currently been in the game for a while now just stick them at a stick them at uh random rarities like for example surge pretty complex brawler put them at a legendary status you know because no, let's be honest it's not visually pleasing to just to see a bunch of uh chromatic brawlers and i just think this would be like a, a freshing up things a little bit you know because let's be honest they're the rare and super rare even if you can buy them are not don't have as many as um epic and legendaries and mythics do like i feel like every brawler that's been released other than gus have just always been higher rarity i just think this would be like a freshen up like make things just look nicer i've already said it make things look nicer that's that's generally what i want i have ocd and i just don't like how there are 15 chromatic brawlers and they're going to be releasing more with every single brawl pass another thing they could do which i don't really like but it's like it's like i'm just like spitballing ideas here is when they release a brawler instead of like just completely getting rid of the chromatic rarity and just like hey this is the newest brawler it's an epic status after the brawl pass it's going to be going to an epic status which could spark the theory like what if it's a rare no one's going to want to buy a rare no one's going to spend like ten dollars to get a rare brawler like that's stupid even though a lot of you a lot of youtubers i'm gonna get you guys time will say it doesn't matter about the brawler the rare the the, the value is there but you know ten dollars is ten dollars let's be honest like i'm not someone who buys a brawl pass i haven't bought in a while because you know ten dollars is ten dollars and yeah this is like a, another thing and another thing which is a complex thing so you gotta like stick with me here really sit down and listen they go through the current status of legendary, mythic, and then epic, keeping the chromatic background. And then after that, Brawl Stars puts them into a new rank. So, for example, Surge, I'm looking at you again. It goes from legendary status, mythic, epic, and then the season after that, it is now put into a random rarity. Not really random because it obviously we thought out. It, like it would go to a legendary. Now, the thing that's like makes it complex is. There are going to be a lot of theory people who are going to look at a brawler and be like, hmm, this new brawler that's been released. Hmm. It's not that hard to play. Good chance it's going to be a rare. I'm not going to buy the brawl pass, which could, like, again, with the whole, like, thing I said previously, if they were to release, like, a rare into the brawl pass is no one's going to want to get it. So I do think, like, the first thing that I said is, like, you know, just take, like, half the chromatic brawlers that are already released in the game that are currently at an epic status and just put them in a new rarity. It doesn't really matter. If it's higher, it's tough. But if it's lower, it's like, oh, cool, I have an easier chance of unlocking this brawler. So, yeah, that's what I want to discuss in today's video. If you are new to the channel, leave a like, subscribe, and, yeah, thank you guys for watching.